Well, I thought, you know, great to get first win in the books for Team 127, but the first inning couldn't have gone any better uh, in terms of wanting us to face some adversity and get tested and then see a response. And so when everything, when, when everything was going haywire and not to plan, we lead off the game with an error and then we, you know, it's just like a couple of base hits with on two strike counts and a pass ball with the bases loaded and guys move up 270 feet. It's just like the wheels look like they were falling off, but I thought Billy Barlow did an unbelievable job, not only getting a couple of big strikeouts to minimize damage for a two spot in the top of the first, but then the response of our team to score seven in the bottom of the frame with Alden's grand slam, Cam's three run, two out double, uh, and then just some of the big hits throughout the night and the hard contact throughout the night. Uh, Nolan Rockies, you know, first career homer is a, is a grand slam. Cooper Glauser's first career hit as a Tiger is a, is a home run. Um, first collegiate hit is a home run. Alden's first Clemson hit is a grand slam. There's just a lot of cool storylines, but, um, one of the big storylines, just the way our pitching settled the game down the second through the eighth inning. You know, Billy putting zeros up, second, third, fourth, fifth, Drew Titsworth coming in, uh, the sixth, the seventh, the eighth. You know, we had no walks in, in that, the, that period of time. We had a couple of hit by pitches, but no, only had a couple of walks there in the ninth. But just thought our, our pitching staff did a really good job of keeping the defense engaged, letting them make plays. Uh, and then I thought we had a lot of quality at bats. Hit the ball hard all night. Uh, ended up with a few homers. Didn't really have to do much in terms of uh, you know running the bases because we were able to to you know separate a little bit early and their catcher can really throw. But just you know that's a really good club. Xavier's a regional team and they were in a regional final last year and they've got an offense that can score runs. And so for for us to put those zeros up in the middle of the game was big. Um, so just proud of our guys. Glad to get game. Win number one, game one out of the way. And, uh, you know, I know our guys are happy about this, but be hungry for more as this weekend moves on. That offense, I mean, that first inning, it was hit, 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 grand slam. It just collectively came together and put up a bunch of runs. And, you know, I sat there and talked to uh, Corey Schaefer, one of our uh, mental, um, mental game training guys. And uh, we, he picked my brain a little bit and noticed what the problem was and just went, went back out there and did, did it. I mean, I went on to the offense, so they really put me back in the game and got me back to where I wanted to be. It's unbelievable. I mean, like Billy said, I mean, the three guys that got on in front of me were, were the reason that happened. We saw a lot, a lot of pitches and was able to get the pitch I was looking for. I mean, the atmosphere is electric and obviously it's a moment I'll remember for the rest of my life.